okay for creating a cv first we will go to design tab then from here slide size go to custom slide size then from this little arrow icon select a full paper and before clicking ok make sure this one should be portrait and click on ok and from here click on maximize ok so my basic page size is ready and our CV style will be like this one so let's make it from design tab first go to insert and from shape option select rectangle and draw a rectangle select the rectangle and from format option give no outline and fill color dark gray now I will insert a picture in my canvas first go to insert then click on picture and insert your picture this picture is not look better and I will make it rounded shape and for make it round or circle just select the image and from format option go to crop crop to shape and select oval hello sorry for interrupt for watching more of our videos check the link i have written here i'll make it exactly rounded circle okay you should use your professional passport size photo now select your image go to format option and from picture border give a white border and again go to picture border and give weight like this one okay now i will give my name here you see an example in the second slide for this first go to insert wordart select the simple one place it here and type your name select all your object and give the font style to as in cfv and i am reducing my text size like this one place it here i am just select the text box and press ctrl t for duplicating and i am giving here my nickname select all of my text pressing ctrl a and now increase the text size to 54 and select all of my text make it bold and from here i'm choosing red if you don't want any shadow in your text then you can withdraw it okay now place it properly again select this text box and press ctrl t and place it here and give your text i'm giving my few professional skill select all of your text and reduce it and again press ctrl g from here and i'm giving my another skill here okay you can make it bold but i am not going to do this and from here i will give my basic contract information and for this select your any text and press ctrl t put it here and i'm giving my mobile number here and if i zoom it in i can just reduce the text size to 14 and again press ctrl t select a text box and i'm here i'm giving my email address select this one and this one and from format option from align select alignment from right and it looks now better now i will give to arrow sign in here for this go to insert shape and select this one and draw the arrow you can resize your arrow sign just by dragging the yellow dot okay now go to format option from shape field make it red from outline no outline and press ctrl t and put it exactly here select this text select the text box and press ctrl t for duplicating and put it here and i will change the text color black to white and give your segment education put it in the right position and select this one and press ctrl t put it here rotate it 180 degree angle place it here make it a little bit larger like this one and from format option give shape outline white okay select this one and this red shape and press on ctrl t just for duplicating okay i am pressing ctrl and scrolling down my mouse just to minimize it and place it properly okay and now again select this one and this red shape and press ctrl t for duplicating and place it exactly here now select this one and type experience this one and type skill and try to make three equal now i will give my education in here then experience then skill so for keeping education i'm selecting this one then this text box and press ctrl t for duplicating and place it here and i'm giving my 
education in here and select this one this text box and press ctrl t giving her session with i will reduce the text size from here okay so i give my education and experience in here and now i will give my skill in the bottom part of cv from here select any text and select that text box and press ctrl t for duplicating and give your any skill i'm giving digital marketing select this one press ctrl t place it exactly here then again press ctrl t ctrl t and now from insert tab from shape rectangle and draw a shape like this one from shape fill make it no fill and from shape outline make it red and now again go to insert shape rectangle and draw a rectangle exactly above the previous rectangle and select the box and shape fill make it red shape outline no outline select this one and give your skill level here like I am working on digital marketing almost one year and learn lots and that's why I am giving this one like this then select this one and this one and press ctrl T and place it here again press ctrl T ctrl T and give your skill level Okay, my CV is almost ready. Now I will keep some shape for this to meet in. Go to insert, shape, rectangle, and draw a rectangle above this. From format option, shape fill, no fill, shape outline, dark gray. Now select the box and press Ctrl T and place it here. Again, press Ctrl T. Okay, my CV is ready and if you want to give a shape like this then what you will do just go to insert tab from shape option select rounded rectangle pressing shift draw a rectangle then from shape outline an outline shape fill dark gray again go to insert shape and select this pie and pressing shift draw a pie and now put it exactly center of your circle select this one and go to format option shape fill red shape outline no outline and give your skill level here like you can do this like this one you can make it to here or anywhere you want to give it I want to give my digital marketing skill from here okay like this and just go to insert word art select the simplest one put it here and write your skill make enter from home tab reduce the text size change the color okay and if you want you can give different font style thank you so much guys for watching this video and hope you understand all this video and if you don't understand any part of this video then please leave a comment what you don't understand feel free to leave a comment Whatever it is, it might be a positive or negative or it might be a suggestion or if you don't understand, obviously you would say us. So, see you again in the next video and make sure you have subscribed our channel Amazing Warrior.